Both of them ended up having to go to the hospital uh, because of injuries sustained in the game. When Dallas and Chicago played each other, it was more than just two teams playing. For the fans, it means everything because it's the first real rivalry. It wasn't forced on by the league. It was all because of the fans. It was Chicago's first year in the league. That very first year, we were coming off winning the Open Cup title. Uh, we always had a pretty good rivalry, so being champions and them knocking us off created a lot of bitterness towards that rivalry. We knocked them out after being down 2-0 at home. So I remember just like it was yesterday, and we got to celebrate with the fans. Uh, it was just a great feeling. The best team during my tenure. You know, these, these rivalries and the whole brimstone and all that sort of thing, you know, they, they start basically, you know, there's usually an incident that happens. I remember a situation where one of the players in Chicago broke one of our defender's leg, snapped it, just a, just a terrible foul. Oh, you gotta be joking. Oh, you don't want it. This is absurd. The, the media jumps on it and now, you know, it's this hated rivalry. So I think those things are good. They, they're good for the fans, they're good for the players, you know, it gets everybody, you know, psyched up. You know, Bob's a great coach, so it, it was something that the coaching staff very much looked forward to as well. And it seemed like every year then we played Chicago and critical matchups in the playoffs which just made that rivalry grow and grow.